What's happening friends, Don here with TroTech Laser Hacks. Today we're gonna to look at some tips and tricks focused on improving your laser skills. Let's get started. In this week's laser hack, we've got a fantastic trick for adding value to any custom engraved piece using paint fills without the hassles and headaches of paper masking. The secret to this hack is our liquid masking, which enables us to achieve a stunning final effect with a simple streamlined workflow. Products like these are readily available from a number of online retailers and should all function in roughly the same way. To start, pour out a small amount of your liquid masking and brush it onto your chosen material. Less is often more in this stage and you're aiming for a thin, even coating across the entire piece. After leaving the mask to dry for several hours, place your product into the laser and run your engraving as normal. Because the coating is so thin, it should not require any special adjustments to your laser settings. Use whatever power and speed settings you feel best suit your material. For this example, we've chosen to engrave and paint fill this highly detailed border, which would be incredibly difficult to achieve using paper mask due to the high time investment required to remove and weed it after laser processing has completed. Once the product is finished engraving, remove it from your laser machine and paint inside the engraving using whatever color or colors you and your customers have chosen. Once the paint is dried completely, simply peel off your masking. In our experience, gentle use of a scouring pad or duct tape will quickly and easily remove masking even in areas of high detail. The final product is a seamless, beautiful paint fill that is rich in detail and perceived value. This process also works well on oblong or oddly shaped products that can be difficult to effectively mask using paper masking. Although liquid masking will not work on rough or raw woods, it can still be applied in a wide variety of applications. It favors materials that are smooth or coated with a clear polish, including polished stone, glass, plastics, or lacquered wood, as we've shown here. Thank you so much for watching, and a huge thanks to Dave Stevens and our friends at TroTech Laser USA. You can find a link to them in the description below. Stay tuned for more hacks in the future. 